Morning. We are now wrapping up day three of winter storm cleanup and the temperatures are just beginning to drop. As of about six o'clock tonight, the city of Cleveland says about two thirds of residential streets have been plowed a second time. And Akron says it is on second passes as well. But the issue for tomorrow is going to turn to dealing with ice. As all that snow started to melt today, it's going to create slick spots on your roads, your driveway, those parking lots, and the sidewalks. So be prepared to use caution tomorrow morning while driving and walking. And with a look at how you can prepare and what cities are doing to help you stay safe, here's Lydia Spara. We are all still digging out from the snowstorm. And yes, this is winter and we are accustomed to this, but a lot of it came down fast and just as fast, it's been melting. I think the biggest area of concern that we typically monitor a lot closer than other areas are the ramps, bridges and overpasses. Amanda McFarland from ODOT says they will be on the roads Wednesday nights. And she says they are targeting the areas of slush and water. Though the big thaw was just one day, the big freeze, is on its way. We use our salt as well as our brine mixture, which is just tap water mixed with our salt to help keep those road temperatures as warm as possible. In Cleveland, they're finally clearing the side streets. They tell 3 News the streets that remain snowed in will be done Thursday morning, but will it be enough to keep the ice away? So those those crews will be patrolling and hitting hitting any spots that um, may be trouble spots. They'll be they'll be hitting those. Let's focus now on our homes. Finish cleaning areas where the snow has melted. Use a de-icer. Put some on the drive, on the walkways, and on the stairs. Some prefer this, a pet friendly de-icer. It's a little bit more expensive, but your pooch will thank you for it. And it might not get rid of the ice, but it could save you a trip to the ER. All right, here's another tip to save you that trip to the ER. I'm using my pet friendly de-icer. So you see the snow was melting right here. This is already starting to form as black ice. So if you're in your driveway, go ahead and start spreading the uh, salt in that area. Another little piece of research I did, if you park your car in the street or in your driveway, go ahead and throw it right there behind your car, behind the wheel. This shouldn't damage because it's environmentally friendly. Also, Betsy, I know you know this one. You can use sand and you can use kitty litter because that won't ruin your car, but all these little tips will help get you out the door in the morning if you have to head to work and there's ice all over the place. Back to you. Yeah, and it's all about traction when you're talking about black ice, certainly, That's Lydia. It. Thank you so much. And we did have.